Hi y'all, this is So So Blessed. Welcome to The Blessed Place. How y'all doing? I'm on my way to work on Tuesday morning and this is just a little um, quick little check-in to let you all know that I'm doing well, I'm doing wonderful. Um, I made We made it through Ian, me and my family. Um, and I know a lot of you reached out to me and uh, a lot of you follow me on um, Instagram and uh, checked in with me. So I just wanted to let the rest of my blessed ones know that um, I'm good. Uh, it Ian really did some damage and caused some devastation. And um, I spent most of Ian at work because most of you know that I'm now one operator, police dispatcher. Uh, so I spent Wednesday and Thursday at work. But when I came, um, I got there Wednesday morning. I didn't leave until Thursday evening, about 6 p.m. or so. And so um, my husband was at home and we basically just didn't have any power. And then when I got home Thursday night, didn't have power until Sunday. Uh, so that, that was the worst um, you know, of it that I experienced was no power. And whew, that was rough <laughs> for a few days. But I know comparatively, nowhere near as rough as some people in Florida have experienced. So my prayers are with those people. Y'all, even on Sunday, you know, I hadn't been around my city. I'm out and about around my city. So I didn't know how bad it was. And you know, I thought the devastation was like in other parts of Florida, like you know, Fort Myers, Naples, which, you know, is probably about three hours from me. So I thought that's where all the damage was, but I didn't know the damage was so close to home until I got home. Um, my husband and I went out on Sunday uh, cause we kind of hibernated until then, but Sunday we went out and about and some houses are underwater, cars are underwater. I mean, just major destruction and devastation and my heart and prayers are, you know, to those people. Um, but I'm so thankful that me, my my mom, my mom got some flooding in our house, but just inches, like maybe four or five inches of water. Nothing like the four or five feet of water that some people experience. And um, so she, you know, she's good. And my, my uh, other family members, they're all good. Um, some people who uh, who shall remain who shall remain nameless, who live in the bougie part of of our city of the city, they did not even get um, any power outage. So some family members hibernated over there. Um, so um, it was it was you know we were we were fine. Me and my family are fine, and I like again I thank everybody. Uh, who reached out, even those who didn't reach out, but thought of me, who said a little prayer uh, for me, who says, hey, don't, don't um, so-so live in Florida. Uh, let me pray for her. So I appreciate it all. Um, so I just, and I'm going to add a little footage at the end of this so that you all can see um, some of the things, just a little snippet of what I saw uh, after we went out and about. So, um, you know, hey, God is good and just like the storms of life, you know, we made it through. Just like the storms of life, you know, we just ho hold on, hold on, keep the keep the faith. Um, don't give up. Don't give in. You know, the, the 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 storm may be raging, the waters may be raging, the flood may be coming, the power may be out, but hold on, keep the faith, and we'll we'll make it over. And we did too. All right, you guys. Love y'all. Just wanted to check in. I love y'all so much. I appreciate you guys. And uh, yeah, I'll see you all. Take care. Y'all be blessed.